I ate two cheeseburgers. Yeah. Hi everyone, this is Ryan with I ate two cheeseburgers, and today I'm going to be playing Hello Neighbor, which is a game I've only ever heard of from my children. So we're going to check it out. Uh, these graphics are pretty cool. I got the lowdown from my five-year-old. I guess I'm a dude that uh, just moved in across the street from some creepy house, and uh, I'm going to go explore it, I guess. Um, so the beginning looks like there's a little tutorial. I have a little checklist here. Things I need to do. Turn on the electricity, check inside, move stuff inside, take a nap. The uh, controls are pretty simple. W is forward, A is left, S is backward, D is right. The space bar jumps. The E button is an activation button. It will turn flip switches, I guess, and open doors. The F button will allow us to pick things up. And then on the mouse, I believe the right mouse button lets us throw things. We're going to find out in a second, I think, here. Um, yep, right mouse button's gonna throw, we just threw a box. So, I got a big pile of stuff, I guess I need to, uh, get that inside. So, I found a key here, we're gonna put the key in the lock. You know, we're gonna use the left mouse button, is gonna let us, I guess, use our, whatever we pick up, if we're holding something. That's good to keep in mind. Um, I do not think these things stay written down it seems like they disappear so uh, it says right mouse button will let us throw the left mouse buttons letting us use this key so uh, we're checking out the inside I guess my house only has two rooms that's not very cool but hey you know whatever so back to the checklist I gotta take this stuff inside so uh, I don't move too fluid I am uh, <laughs> Not that adept at playing games yet. I just uh, started again. I haven't played in a long, long time. But uh, the kids think it's fun, and it is pretty fun. The graphics on this are pretty pretty amazing. Um, I think there's some kind of uh, artificial intelligence engine that uh, the neighbor actually runs on. So it should get smarter as we go. Uh, this is not the full version of the game. It doesn't come out for a couple weeks. Um, so this is one of the uh, alpha releases. And uh, we're just giving it a check here. I'm still running around trying to get all this stuff inside, see if I can get the checklist to uh, to disappear so we can move on to the next part of the game. But uh, picking up multiple things here. I got four four slots I can pick up stuff, so see if we can get this stuff inside pretty quick. Here we go. And I got to throw it all one at a time. And check again, see if it, if I got my, uh, my, here we go, I can't read. Here we go, take a nap. All right, I think this is the end of the first part here to, to learn how to move kind of tutorial section press E to take a nap and it's just going to start us over I guess it's the next day we went to sleep and now we get a play so I'm not much for exploring I'm going to go straight to it here we're going to look around real quick no cars maybe pick up this flashlight here might come in handy chair probably not but we'll go ahead and throw that that's all right hey <laughs> there are other people so this must be a really creepy dude here Let's see i don't see anything useful over here let's go up to the um i think that's a bear trap <laughs> a bear trap hope my neighbors don't have a bear trap on their front porch but hey could come in handy let's take it with us see what happens here all right here we go. Now my kids love this, so there's got to be something freaky going on. I'm not sure. But uh, we're going to explore around here and see what we can't find. To the uh, dining room. Let's uh, set this bear trap down see if anything happens. I don't know. Um, I've turned the background music off. There is background music and noise. 
Uh, it just makes it a little easier for me to uh, talk. I just knocked a picture off the wall. It's probably going to get somebody's attention. I think the guy is hunting us, but I'm not sure if he actually knows we're here. I think the point of the game is to sneak around and see what we can find. Um, I think there's a torture chamber or something at the end, but I'm not sure. I get my rundown from a five-year-old, so <laughs> so my uh, my expertise is limited. So we're just going to keep going here. See what we can do. I'm not sure what that is. But, uh, the old, hey, we're at the back side of uh, whatever dining room we were at because there was my bear trap. And uh, let's just check these out, see if we can open any of these rooms. Nope, this one's locked or something. So, go down here. It's kind of kind of weird. <laughs> but, uh, uh-oh, the music just changed. Of course, I haven't muted 2K. Oh, there's a dude. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh. I just got attacked, I think. So, uh, now it's nighttime, and I'm back in my bedroom, I guess. <laughs> I lost that one. So, here we go again. Let's try this again. Now it's nighttime. And... Run across the street here. Let's maybe we'll take a different approach this time and see what we can do. Uh, I'm gonna go straight in here. Now it's dark, and now the bear trap. That is not where I put the bear trap. So <laughs> someone's on this. Oh, I hear him. Oh, 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 oh! I think he's coming. I think he's coming. I think he's coming. Maybe not. Maybe not. So it plays a really creepy sound when he walks into the room. That's why I started running um so maybe you can get away when he shows up but uh is he there uh oh oh no oh oh he threw something what what i just got i just got hit by something so uh did we get it? oh nope here he comes i guess once he sees you you don't get away all right here we go let's try a third oh wait what's this oh, okay we got a little animation here is this uh probably important it's a big crash and a tire a big crash and a tire so but that is not the garage we went into the garage it was to the other side so now it's nighttime and we're gonna try this again that's the last time I'm gonna try this this go around we'll give it a give it one last go and uh See what happens. So I uh, gotta get around that fence. I guess we can't walk over these things. I don't see them in the kitchen here. It's around here. We're going to the back of the house. Just gonna do a little exploring this time instead of just running straight through the door. Oh, we got an electric box. Let's see what uh, we could flip it on 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 the uh, my house. Let's see if we can. Oh yeah. Let's cut the electricity. See what that works. I don't know if it'll distract him. I don't know if it'll make it dark. I don't know if it actually does anything, but we went ahead and hit it anyway, so let's give it a go. All right, here we go. There was, we did pass a back door, it looks like. We'll have to check that the next time we go. And uh, for some reason that, uh, oh, I didn't, didn't mean to go up there. Uh, the exit light is lit, but now that door we saw him go through has is barricaded pretty good so I guess uh, let's look around see if we can find anything cool we can get um, uh oh <laughs> he got us nowhere to go alright well guys hey this was a, uh, a good first attempt I think for uh, this game and uh, if you like what we're doing here you know please subscribe and keep following us leave some comments of uh, anything you'd like to see us do or do better and uh, have a good day